Bicycles have completely transformed my life. The bike has taken me from a cubicle lifestyle to this nomadic professional cycling lifestyle. In a sense, I think because of the crash, I tried something different. I graduated from Dartmouth in June 2005 and I started in July 2005 at Lehman Brothers. And you got your signing bonus when you, you got your job offer, you were being paid well. It was definitely um, kind of a booming time, it felt like, to be working in that industry. My favorite boss told me once, Evie, this is going to go boom. This isn't going to last that long. I saw such negative energy. I saw it on the subway. You could kind of just feel it. Just, it just wasn't positive. And I think for me, I saw that and I realized I didn't want to be tied to it. I wanted to feel liberated. That sense of angst, I guess you could almost describe it, tickled something in me to realize, hey, maybe this isn't what you want to be doing. Why aren't you doing something you're, you know, 100% passionate about? I decided sometime in the spring of 2009 to leave my job. In that first weekend, I won my first professional race in the U.S., so it kind of just started to snowball after that. Working in finance and bike racing, there are a good number of similarities between the two lifestyles, especially investment banking. It was all-encompassing, and that's very similar to cycling. I worked at Lehman Brothers, and I worked in the finance world, but you're kind of just a cog in this big wheel. I think the main thing I learned was just to, to live every day and, you know, and to take opportunities. I love this. I love riding my bike. I know for this time period in my life that this is, this is where I should be. It's nice to have ha jumped off the path and realize that you can be successful doing non-traditional things.